Hello friends! Today, we thought we would share with you a Disney haul. So we kind of went through three different events. So we went through Star Wars Celebration, yep. our Disney, uh, Run Disney 5K, and then we had just our regular Disney vacation that we like to buy souvenirs from. Without, with that said, without further ado, let's get started. So first and foremost, I thought we would show you guys what we got from Star Wars Celebration, and these were specifically from uh, the Disney Parks, like, booth. booth. There we go. That was at Celebration, yeah. Um, I got the 40th uh, anniversary <laughs> tank top, and Lewis got the 40th anniversary uh, t-shirt, which he actually found at Disney. Found it um, in the launch bay in Hollywood Studios. Lewis got his last Jedi t-shirt as well from the from the parks booth. The Force for Change one. Mm -hmm. But yeah, I really like this one. So I like I the fact that it's not just black. <laughs> yeah. It's not black, it's not gray, it's a different color um, that you don't normally see, which I thought was really cool. But speaking of black, um, we got these t-shirts, the uh, Star Wars The Last Jedi Celebration t-shirts. Uh, we actually got them right before we left, but we thought we would include them because they are technically part of the haul. So next, we thought we would show you, this is another thing that we purchased right before we left, uh, but we got like as part of Celebration, which were the- uh, The 40th special edition lanyards. Yeah, and it's really cool yeah. on the back. I'll show you guys a close up, but it has the 40th anniversary Star Wars mm -hmm. logo. Um, on the back of this, which is pretty cool. And this was just to hold our passes while we walked around, which uh, you have to be wearing them, yep. so. And it's really cool yep. too, because on the back they have the logo for the Star Wars Celebration in yep. Orlando. Okay, so there are a few things that we bought. Let's, you know what, we're gonna, we're gonna start with pins, because this kind of goes from, um, this kind of goes through all three of the events. So we bought pins from each event. Uh, the first one we got was from Celebration. This was the Star Wars 40th anniversary, which whenever you open it up, it says, may the force be with you. And it has the logo on the inside, which is really cool. I don't know, I just really wanted to get a pin from, from Celebration. This was the one that I really liked. Yep. And then next. We also got the 45th anniversary of Magic Kingdom pin. Mm -hmm. uh, we, they had shirts and stuff, but we just decided to go with a pin. Next, uh, we got these two pins from uh, from Run Disney, and these are just commemorative, limited release pins. Mm -hmm. uh, one is the logo for for the Star Wars 5K, and then the other one is the medal that mm -hmm. you get. For the it, it's it's like a it's like a baby version of the medal. <laughs> which, speaking of our medals, yep, here are the uh, medals. we got our. Star Wars 5K medals. Uh, this, once again, this isn't like something that we, I mean, we bought, but like we didn't buy while being there, but we got it. You get what yeah. I mean. So still in the vein of Run Disney, we got our uh, t-shirts that they gave out uh, if you were running the uh, 5K. But we also bought the I Did It 5K shirt mm -hmm. as well. And you Just could, one for both of us. Yeah, because we figured we don't really need two. Um, and also, what's nice about this is you get it in the Run Disney shop at the expo yep. whenever you go. So, yeah, we felt like it, it was appropriate. We had to get it. <laughs> okay, and still going on with clothing, I finally got my Monsters University hat. I have been oh. wanting to buy this hat for years, like probably since the first year it came out, when the movie came out and we went to Disney. I wanted this hat so bad and I kept putting it off and putting it off, but this year I said no more, I was getting it, so. Did it. We got our Monsters University hat. Uh, so I got this sweater, I don't know what the technical name of this it is. Sweater. It, yeah, it's just a sweater. I bought it from uh, the Mouse Gear in Epcot. Mm -hmm. And I love it because it's kind of like that university kind of style. Uh, and it has Walt Disney World on the back of it. And one thing I will mention, if you guys find this online from, you know, like the Disney Store Parks Authentic, be very careful. It runs very large. <laughs> I ended up getting a medium and, because I was swimming in the large. And this is still relatively big on me. Mm -hmm. So um, yeah, just, just be mindful of that whenever, if you decide to get it or order it. 
And then I got this blue hoodie. And now this one's the opposite of the black sweater. If you want this one, go as large as you go one size up. So this has the uh, Walt Disney World logo that they're kind of running with now, mm -hmm. like their main logo and main theme, yep. which I kind of like. I really, I think it's cool. And then like if you look inside of it's the- It's got um, different parks and stuff on it too. Yeah, and it has, so. it's, it's cute. It's pretty cool. I like it. For the last clothing item, I got this little rain jacket from Uniqlo mm -hmm. uh, at Disney Springs because I really needed a rain jacket because I didn't want to wear a poncho and yeah, and, and this yeah. one and this one has Mickey on it, so it was totally worth it. Well, and it's really nice and light too. Mm -hmm. It's not like overly heavy, which is nice when you're in Florida and it rains because it generally rains and it gets humid. Yeah. Uh, so I definitely like the fact that it's super light. And Japan is uh, one of our favorite countries in Epcot, so I love their store. And one of the things that we were determined to get this trip were rice bowls, and then also we were determined again because since. Since we got engaged, we wanted to get a new incense burner. Since we were engaged, that was four years ago. Yep. We've gone to Disney every year since then. And every year we said we were gonna get an incense and burner. We and, and we never did. Now. Yes. We were determined. Uh, but yeah, we just got this little kind of circular pot yep. kind of incense burner. It's nice because it'll burn down and then it, everything gets yeah, caught in the middle. Yep. And then you can just like, dump it out yep. and our wood one's getting pretty pretty well loved so <laughs> um so next we got some things for the kitchen which i got these mickey reusable straws mm -hmm. which are adorable and they have like little mickeys all over yep. them and we also got mickey corn holders because we don't have any corn holders no and since it's spring summertime now I'm gonna be making lots of corn, so we figured these be great. So we got these Disney tumblers. Lewis loved my Starbucks one uh, so much that he had to get one of his own. Uh, so I got this one uh, from the Epcot International Flower and Garden Festival, and I just really loved the Minnie Mouse pattern here. It is just so cute. And then on the back you have Minnie Mouse and you have Figma. I'll show you guys a close up because yep. it's kind of hard to see. So I forgot to mention during while we were talking about all the stuff that we got from the 5k, we did also get our magnet. But we get a magnet every single time we go to Disney. It's just kind of become a tradition of ours. Um, and we decided to get this one yep. this year because it was, you know, the 5k. Yep. And then uh, the last thing for the kitchen was this little silicone uh, hot plate yep. because this one has Minnie Mouse on it and we have the Mickey one mm -hmm. uh, but we didn't have the Minnie Mouse one yep. so we decided that Mickey always needs his Minnie yep. so we got that. So for some uh, tasty treats first and foremost we got these I don't know how to say this name at all I cannot read it uh, but basically what they are they're chocolate like Filled marshmallows. marshmallows and they're so good. They're so delicious. And we also got as a treat some chocolate tears, milk chocolate raisins. Mm -hmm. yeah. Yeah. They were just a quick, yep. like, as we were leaving, we're like, hmm, these sound good. Let's sound pick good. them up. We'll <laughs> and then, last but not least, for me is uh, these Vera Bradley. I got two items I got the key lanyard and then I got the mini wallet, which is so cute. I love I love these. But the thing that really drew, I did not need to have a Vera Bradley Disney lanyard. She did. But I decided that I needed it after I saw that the clasp, like the key holder clasp part was Mickey Mouse shaped. Like, I mean, how, how can you pass this up? And of course, going to Disney, we could not forget our pup, uh, Coda. So we got him a little harness, which is the perfect type of harness for him. It's just so cute because it has so many Mickeys. And this is from the Disney Tales line. Yep. And we also got him a Mickey Mouse Club ear chew She's toy. so cute. Yeah, sorry if it's all hairy and chewy. Yeah, we, already. We, we already gave it to him. Yeah. <laughs> he wasn't happy with it. And it's got squeakers in the ear. Yeah, he loves chewing on the ears. It's mm. great. And it's really tough too. So yep. I mean, it's already holding up pretty well. Mm -hmm. So that's a bonus for him. Whew. That was that was a long haul. Yeah. I guess so. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed that look at what we got from Walt Disney World and also our Star mm -hmm. Wars celebration 
adventure. You can follow us on Instagram and also Twitter. I'll leave the links down below for all of those. Stay in uh, contact with us and find out what we're up to. Uh, also, don't forget to hit that subscribe button for more Disney vlogs, which are coming super soon. And when I say super soon, I mean you guys are gonna have a trailer next week. Exciting! Um, and then Disney vlogs will be starting after that. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed and we will see you guys next time. Bye everyone. Bye. <laughs>